There are all sorts of myths attached to almost every aspect of retirement. And if you're not careful, this kind of misinformation might cost you a comfortable retirement. As a matter of fact, we have talked about on this channel that the traditional retirement is a complete lie and something more radical is needed. But let's clear up these myths first because you got to get these out of the way. You got to get them out of your head. So myth number one is you can figure it out along the way to retirement instead of planning. If you aren't planning and then revising and changing those plans as you go along, then you are planning to fail. It really is that simple, guys. I mean, how do you possibly know what you need to do today to retire in 20 years if you're just kind of figuring it out along the way? That inevitably leads to statements like, well, I'll worry about it next year. Or you will say something like, when I make X amount of dollars, then I'll start planning. The reality is you probably won't. And if that's been your plan all along, tell me kind of how that's going, where you're at right now. Are you on track with your plan? I guess you can't really answer that question because there is no plan in the first place. You don't set out on a cross country bike ride by simply jumping on your bike and kind of pedaling in a direction. But that's exactly what most people do when it comes to retirement. I wish there was, but there is no Google Maps to keep you on track or to get you back on track. So a failure to plan is simply planning to fail. Myth number two is you're gonna work comfortably in your retirement. Retirees who do work when they're retired will do it because they want to work, but unfortunately some do it because they actually have to. And what makes this even worse is the reality is as you age, you cannot bank on making the same amount of money you did before or even being healthy enough to work at all. It's tempting when you're in your 40s and 50s and then kind of in your prime earning years and you really enjoy your job to think you can just keep this up into your 70s and your 80s and keep right on living how you're living. But health and simple company cutbacks become a reality at some point in time for everyone. I run across people over and over again who were laid off in those prime years and the job was given to somebody half their age at half the salary. And unfortunately, whether that's right, whether that's wrong, that is the reality of the system that we have today. So banking on big checks working in retirement is a poor bet to make. And myth number three is you can retire on social security alone. While it is true that retirees do receive social security benefits when they retire, these benefits are not designed to fund your entire retirement lifestyle. It's up to you to establish a robust retirement portfolio today. You gotta have one. And if I'm being honest in the future, I think we will see more cuts to social security, making it even less feasible for future generations to use it to retire. But here are the numbers, here are the facts for you. Just over 1900 is what the average social security payout is, which is very hard to live on in today's economy. Myth number four, you'll have enough money to retire if you invest up to your 401k match and nothing else. Maxing out your workplace 401k is a great way to start investing for your retirement. However, you should not simply stop investing because you reach the match limit that you have in there. And if you have a Roth 401k, it's recommended you invest the full 15% into that account. I also recommend investing in real estate with your primary house through house hacking and also investing outside your retirement accounts as well. Long gone are the days of a pension making up for all the different gaps that you have in retirement. It's all on you in the end. And with the magic number to retire approaching $3 million, your match is probably not going to cut it and get you there. Now, thankfully, this channel is about creating alternative retirements they don't want you to know about. So make sure you're subscribed so you don't miss that content. But we got to get to the last myth, which is it's too late to save for retirement. There is always time to save for retirement and grow your retirement savings. Now, sure, you may be in your 60s and blown it up to this point, but that just means you need to modify what retirement is realizes that's all a lie anyways, and then move forward with a definitive plan on how to do that and create a dream retirement that you didn't think was possible in the first place. It is possible, it's just not going to be what's in your head and what you currently are thinking about. And you have to understand that it's not too late. And you can help save your finances if you're in that situation by clicking this video right here. I agree our system is broken and this channel is about showing you the real truth behind finance, retirement, and entrepreneurship. So make sure you subscribe whether you're 25 or 65 years old, this applies to you. So thanks for watching and I'll see you guys in the next one.